How's it going everyone? Lucian Sword here, playing some more Brawl of you guys today. As always, hope you're all having a beautiful day, wherever you guys might be. So today, we're going to be playing the fastest legends in Brawlhalla. I don't think I've ever made a video on the fastest legends in Brawlhalla. So, there's actually four legends that have eight speed by default in Brawlhalla, which is the most that any legend has currently. I'm still waiting for them to come out with a 9 speed legend that you could bump up to 10 speed. We do have a, a 9 strength legend. We have Zul, right? You can bump that up to 10 strength. We have a 9 defense legend. You can bump that up to 10 defense with Magyar. But we don't have a 9 dexterity or a 9 speed legend that I know of. So, unless, unless I'm forgetting somebody, but I'm pretty sure. No. But there are 4 legends that have 8 speed. Those 4 legends are Hattori. So you can bump her up to 9 speed. You got Artemis, you can bump Artemis up to 9 speed. You got Lucian, you can bump him up to 9 speed. And Mako. I just realized three out of these four legends are female. Hmm, how come the how come the girls are all faster than the boys, huh? <laughs> but anyways, we're going to play with these four legends today. So I guess we'll just go ahead and start it out with Mako. But we're going to go 9 speed on all four of these. Just for fun, just to play... The fastest legends. I'm the type of person that I, I really, really like fast legends. I've always preferred faster legends or, over slower legends, but that's just my personal preference. What do you guys think? Do you prefer speed or do you prefer defense? Do you prefer strength or do you prefer dexterity? Um, or do you just prefer to have rounded, well-balanced stats? Just go ahead and let me know in the comments because I'm interested to know what you guys think is the most important stat or, or do you just prefer, you know, well-rounded legend? Personally, I, I prefer speed over everything else, but, you know, if a legend is well-rounded as well, that, that's, that's, that's good too. You can never complain about a well-rounded legend, I feel like. This person is really good with the blaster, so we're gonna have to be very careful. But Mako is just so much faster than Nyx over here. Don't hit me with that neutral sig. Oh my gosh, okay. All right, first stock doesn't matter. You may have won the battle, but the war is far from over. Got her with the side sig. That's an easy KO, man. Mako signatures are some of the best in the game. Can't deny it. She plays a very grounded game, which I'm kind of hoping she keeps playing like that because it makes killing her very easy with my down sig and side sig, you know what I mean? Ooh. I almost got her with that. Let's go up here. I don't like fighting down there with a the scythe, you know what I mean? Boom! Oh my goodness, that down sig off the edge, it just like sucks everybody into it and they just can't get out of it. It's great. Almost got her with that. Ooh, I'm not dead, I'm not dead. Told ya, told ya, told ya. That side sig get me back every time. Donk, let's go. That's a game, that's a game. Oh my gosh, I, I actually killed myself. She almost saved me, but the corner of the bottom of the stage bought me. <laughs> Psych, I'm not getting that weapon. I gotta be careful. Oh, never mind. We good. No! No, we good. We good. Yep. Oh! That was so close. I don't like fighting a scythe off stage. 
And that's the very reason why. You can get gimped if you're not careful. GG though, dude. GG. The first match is a win. Feels good. Drop a like if you enjoyed this kind of episode where I'm showing the fastest legends in Brawlhalla. Next up, we are going to go Lucian. Lucian has 9 speed, so... Ooh, wow, that looks really good with the Frozen Forest. I guess I'll use that. I never really use this uh, color scheme that much. Lucian. Now, because he has 9 speed, he only has 3 strength! Which means I gotta hit so many times to knock them out, but it's okay. It's not as hard to hit so many times when you got Blasters and when you got Katars. And honestly, Lucian has really good 6, and it's not as hard to get kills as the 3 strength would suggest. I mean, Lucian's Katar down sig just dominate. It's so, it hits so strong. So you don't need to worry about Lucian only having three, three strength. Two, All right, going against Blue V, this guy's playing a Skyforge Zariel. Very cool skin. That skin is from the first battle pass, I think, or the second, one of those two. I don't remember. The best part about playing a 9-speed legend is nobody is going to be faster than you. You know what I mean? You just don't have to worry about it. Ooh, that was a great down air. So he likes to do the side light into neutral six, so we're going to definitely remember that. Oh my goodness, Blue, with the gauntlet combos. Ooh, we got it there though. He likes to play fast. Oh, we could play that game. Just like that, we got him damaged up. Wow, that was so close. We brought it all the way back though. Ooh, that down sig hit him hard. Get that out of here. We brought it all the way back and took that stock. Put down the crocky, sir. Oh, the zero to death gimp. Let's go, Lucian. Woo. And just so you guys know, my name, my YouTube name, Lucian Sword, it is nothing to do with the Brawlhalla legend Lucian. They're spelled different. <laughs> my name has an A in it and Lucian has an E. I actually made my YouTube channel name way before I even started doing Brawlhalla, or, or <laughs> before I even knew what Brawlhalla was. Anyways, that's another story. I'm going to the next 9 strength legend, you guys, which is Hattori. We're gonna go to Hattori. I have every Hattori skin and they're all really, really good. Um, hmm. I don't know which one to use because I love them all, but I think I'm gonna go with Kill Thrill Hattori. You don't see this one too often. We're gonna go black, and I think I'm just gonna leave the weapons as they are. But we're going 9 strength today. Hattori is the original fast legend, man. When I first started playing Brahalla, Hattori was considered the best legend in the game. And I think in part just because of how fast she was. Alright, here we go. Going against two pretty fast legends. Ember is pretty fast, but Hattori is just a little bit faster. She definitely can beat me on range, although I do have that spear, which can kind of go a little bit farther than her uh, Katars, for sure. Get over there.
Every Ember player, including myself, we always try to get that down sig on the bow because it's pretty much just for style points, but it also feels so good when you hit it, you know? Oh my- what? I didn't touch the wall! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness. It happens to the best of us. Nothing we could do. Oh my gosh. I don't know why she's not engaging. Maybe she assumes I want the weapon. See, a lot of people assume I want the weapon, but sometimes I want to fight unarmed. You just can't assume that. Like, at the beginning of the match, yes, but in the middle of the match, no. I, I like to switch it up. Sometimes I go unarmed, just to mess with them a little bit. That down sig is honestly like my favorite move with the Tori. It's just so fun to hit. I was actually trying to do a side sig there, not a down sig. <laughs> oh my gosh. I think either one would have been bad. Alright, so even it up, last stocks. It all comes down to this. Wow. She almost hit me with that. She never jumps after I sidelight. I tried to do that down sig step back, but I just was not stepping back. GG dude, GG. Well played. I need to remember to taunt after the game's over because I, I never do that and I, I always forget and I'm never gonna complete that challenge to taunt when the game is over. I still need like 10 more taunts. GG though dude, GG. My Hattori's a little bit rusty. I hardly play her, but. All right, last but not least guys, we have Artemis, nine, stra or nine speed Artemis, ooh. I'm gonna go Seraph Artemis. I, I rarely use this skin, just because I like uh, some of the other Artemis skins better. So we'll go Artemis and uh, Seraph Artemis for our final four speed legend. And I'm gonna try to get a win this time because I got a little bit careless on that last game and <laughs> when you get lazy on your attacks, a good player will take advantage. And uh, that person was definitely a good player, that, that uh, Ember. I forget who they were even. All right, going against Jiro. Let's go. Jiro is also a pretty fast legend, but not as fast as... Oh, okay. Hi. That's... Oh. Interesting. All right. He's desperate to get into battle, man. He's got that bloodlust. In the end, it won't make a difference because he's still going to lose. Give him a little bit of handicap damage, to be honest. Doesn't bother me. You know what I mean? If, if they want to come in punching me when I'm giving them the good luck opening taunt, it doesn't bother me anymore. It used to, but now it doesn't because now it's like, you know what? They probably need the handicap. More of a challenge for me, you know? Ooh, don't get lazy assuming I'm not going to come off the stage to get you because I will. Nice, 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 nice weapon throw. I liked it. I liked it. But we got a pretty big advantage here. It would be a travesty for us to lose at this point.
Gojiro. Bye bye. Well played, dude. Well played. So, what do you guys think? Which legend out of these four? Artemis, Hattori, Lucy, and Mako, the four fastest legends in Brawlhalla. Which one do you think is the best? I'm gonna have to go with Mako or Artemis. That's those are my picks. Probably either Mako or Artemis. And uh, but let me know what you guys think in the comments below. As always, guys, this has been my pleasure. I hope you enjoyed. Please drop a like if you do. Subscribe for more Brawlhalla content and Rocket League. And I hope to see you in the next video. Take it easy, guys. This is Lucian Sword.